Okay. God fucking damn it. back. I don't even know what I'm streaming to. I'm also out of breath. Fuck. Woo! Shut up. Alright, well... I'm using my fancy Sea of Thieves controller, you can't really see. I'm not even playing the real game, I'm just playing this beta. Let's see if it even works. We go it alone. I don't want to have to deal with anybody. <clears throat> Can carefully one that there. God damn it, yes, go. So there's other things I could be doing right now. Um, but this beta out of it. I don't know how long I'll play. What to do? Introduce to you. Man, I just ate way too much. And now, there's a mistake. I also put some um, marshmallow fluff on a couple of Reese's peanut butter cups. That's pretty good. I wanted to make them into a sandwich, but then I was like, well, then I only have one thing to eat instead of two. That's kind of a bummer, so I didn't do that. I've been looking at this uh, thing here for a while, all day today. I played a lot of this today, actually, um, at work. This controller's pretty cool. It's got like sea spray all uh, etched into it. It feels much more solid than um, this piece of garbage. This thing here, I bought a while ago. Um, I barely even use it. It's all worn out at the bottom here. Um, it creaks and cracks like a motherfucker. Like I'm playing it and I feel like it just, I don't know, it's, it's not good. Hopefully this doesn't have that issue. It might. These things aren't, things don't feel as good as they did on my laptop, which is strange. So, one of the things I learned about this game is you want to talk to this guy before you do anything. He's the one who gives you your, like, quests. 
Um, I've done this one a couple times. It costs nothing, and it gets you like 34 bucks for doing it. I don't think I've done this one yet. This one here, a day long, embark on this initiation voyage in service of the treasure, gold. They both say day. Alright, fuck it, let's do this one. So I've had some bad experiences um, today with this game of being killed over and over again, um, of just not finding what I'm looking for, which is actually what happened the last time. Uh, I don't have any. Um, this is where your maps go. I had a weird riddle earlier. What the fuck is going on here? Well, that's not usable. Let's go ahead and do this. There's the there's a scuttle ship. I'm not entirely sure what that means. I think it just does this or something. It sucks because I wanted to be out on the ocean with it all bright and sunny like this. There's actually not been very many times where... Alright. There hasn't been a whole lot of me being able to go out voyaging around with such good weather. So when your ship dies, this happens. Um, I'm hoping that this gets fixed after the beta. Oh, okay, that wasn't as bad. I've spent a lot of time today looking at white screens. I wonder if that was somebody... No. I don't know. It feels real good and fun to pilot a ship. If that's what you call it. So it's a little weird the way you start a quest thing when you're by yourself. I have to like put my voyage out on this table and we vote on if we want to start that voyage or not. Um, I'm the only one here though, so of course we're going to fucking do it. I've been learning how to manage the ship easily by myself. Um, now that we have the voyage going, we use... Ooh, it's just a riddle. Okay. Wanderer's Refuge holds riches vast, hidden spoils of voyages past. So we're going to Wanderer's Refuge. So we go here to the table. Wanderer's Refuge. Wanderer's Refuge. I'm hoping that the world is much larger than this because, man, this doesn't seem like enough. Oh, Wanderer's Refuge. Jesus. I was looking too hard. Directly beneath me. Alright, so we're going to come out of here and take a hard left to the south. So I've discovered that a lot of... Well, it's hard to explain right now, but I've kind of learned how to... to um, maneuver my ship without moving it. Because sometimes that you need, sometimes you got to like basically put this bitch in reverse. And that's... Not something you can really do with a ship like this. Where do we go? Going south. Oh, into a storm. So much my good weather. I wonder if it's this big thing right here, or is it that guy over there? So, normally, you know, when you have a ship with a crew, somebody would be, like, navigating. But me, I have to go back here. I can look down here at my map, and I can see, actually. All right. Yep. We want to maybe turn a little bit more south. But other than that, we're good to go. You want to check your sail, I think. I mean, you don't have to go super fast. Sometimes it's a little bit more difficult, but tune your sail there for maximum speed. And there we go. Sailing, uh, you get places kind of faster than you'd think. Like, part of me wants to be like, all right, let's go up in this crow's nest here uh, and see what's going on. There we go. 
by the time I get all the way up here, ooh, this is this is poorly thought out. All right, so there we are. All right, we got more time than I thought. Pretty nifty. I uh, got a spyglass here. Cool. Not really that useful. Okay, so shit. All right, that works. We're going to bring the sails. No, nope, never mind. You run this bitch aground and you're toast. So you got to be pretty careful. I mean, you can patch your ship up and stuff, but what I've been doing is tossing down. I was getting cocky earlier, and I was like trying to like pull up all Ace Ventura like a glove style. Like right, so oh, I'm gonna get shot at, man. I don't fuck. So crank the wheel, get out of here, drop the anchor, drop the anchor. Well, that got all fucked. Yep, see you later, ship. Oh, no, it worked. Yeah, I crank the wheel, drop the anchor, and then it pulls up all... Just like that. So where was I hearing cannon shots from? Oh, yeah, check that shit out. See, I parked it, and it's like backing into a parking spot. So, yeah, this you have to get wet, and then it reveals... Get wet. Walk to the wandering lover's final resting place to the southeast, then honest toil. Eight paces west by northwest. Shut up. I'm not good at these at all. The other ones just give you like a picture. This is not that. To the southeast. I don't even know where I'm at right now. Uh, whoa, you can flip it over? That's neat. How do I... Oh, I probably show... Okay, that's to show other people. I already forgot what it told me. Southeast. Probably should have read this before I got here. Or something. See, this is what happened to me last time. I had one of these little riddly things, and then along the way, I happened across a chest that's just hanging out like this, and I just went back home and cashed it in. I don't know if it's what I was supposed to find. That specifically, because this references being under the soil, I don't think that's what this is. But I get real nervous because if anybody else shows up, they will kill me. I am not equipped for combat in many ways. And I don't think like losing my shit. But, alright. Even though I'd love to just... Like, some asshole could just show up and just hop on my boat and take that. And then I'd be sad. This game has nothing to collect. There's no things that you want to like pick up on these islands besides bananas, boards, and cannonballs. It's so far, anyway... That is all I've come across in this game. There's no loot. There's no picking flowers and crafting shit. Which, you know, kind of... is welcome, but also kind of not. Walk to the Wandering Lover's final resting place to the southeast of an honest toll. Wandering lover's resting place. Like, what does any of those mean? I mean, I think I'm kind of like as southeasty. I mean, could technically be over here in this chunk of island. I didn't even get a good look at what this island looks like. I should have gone to my map on my boat and taken a look at what this island looks like. Because this was stupid. 
I came in here literally blind. There's no maps in this game. This like I can't just push a button and pull up a map that shows me where I am. going as southeast as possible and I'd say this is about it <sighs> so final resting place sure sounds like I don't know this maybe like a busted down camp type thing I don't know how you count paces in this game, for one. I mean, this? No. Get a vantage point. Come on. I feel like it matters right now anyway. Yeah. I'm screwed. I I am so screwed and <laughs> it's getting dark. It really just feels like around here ish. Let me get a dig right here. the soil. That's not sand. West by northwest, so it was right over in this direction. This game's pretty generous about, like, well, I don't really know. Maybe I've gotten lucky a bunch, but when I've dug up other treasures, 
I've been like, I don't know, this approximate area, and then I like shove my thing in the dirt, and it's like always the first try. So it seems like if you're anywhere near where you're supposed to be, it's like, yeah, here you go. And that's not what's happening right now. Dare I say, at least I don't have a bunch of skeletons after me, but that might change. For all I know, my boat's gone. All my stuff is on my boat is gone. Put your dumb fucking shovel away. There are other areas that are technically southeast. It doesn't have to be the most southeast. Hmm. I mean, this is southeast. God, what am I doing? No! Can't wait until I fin or finally figure out the uh, controls. I mean, fuck, am I even at the right island? I might not be. It's always a possibility. Also, is my boat gone? Oh, or I parked it. Because guess what? We're hopping on the boat. If it's here still. I got a chest. It's not the chest I came here for, but it's a chest. I also got the message in the bottle. So at night you want to actually extinguish your lanterns on your boat so that you are less easily spotted by douchebag pirates that want to steal your hard-earned garbage. I can't even see where the ladder is. The game's real dark and it has no um, like brightness settings in the menu. <laughs> I've played on multiple screens now. It's dark on all of them. Wow. All right. Man, it's real dark. I use my own lantern. Straight north. I'm already facing the right direction. All right. Man. Away we go. I can't even see where the anchor is. Oh no! 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 Well, we're heading towards that big batch of lights. It's pretty cool. The uh, you can tell where the ship is, you know, centered. Also, the controller vibrates when you hit that notch.
Sometimes when you can't get a good angle on the wind, it doesn't make a whole lot of sense sometimes where the best part is, where the best angle is. What am I hearing? Wow. Is that coming after me? Oh, Jesus. That can't be from another ship, right? It's got to be from one. Like... Whoa! Rough seas. I'm getting shot at by highly accurate rockets. I don't even know if I was in the right island. Oh, wow, and I'm way going the wrong way. I suppose rough seas will uh, do that to you. I don't think I'm supposed to be going towards that. I guess we can just look up here. Way more right, still. Over there? Oh god, there's a ship over there. Come on. That can't be right, can it? Oh, it is. Alright. Angle yard sails. What I mean, I don't know. I guess that makes sense. I thought that Xbox used like proprietary. Um... Ah, fuck! I don't have a bottle opener. I thought they used proprietary like wireless technology. Like this controller is being used through Bluetooth on my laptop, so. I don't know. Sure, seems like I'm moving real slow, eh? Like real slow. Oh well. I'll turn all my lanterns back on so I can find my ship if I need to. At some point in time. What the fuck? How did I not even see that guy? Well, I'm done. And now you get to see the real fun in this game. These guys are on my boat now. So if I respawn, I respawn back on my boat. Where these guys are. They also just stole my chest. Oh yeah, and you get to have the fun of coming back here when you die. And you just stand on a cool looking boat that... Um, Serves no purpose other than a fancy loading screen. And you wait for this door to bust open down here. And now we can go back. And we appear on my boat. Which might be sinking right now for all I know. This is where you get a lot of white screen. And here's stuff. Cool. Well, now he's dead. And there goes my chest. So now I'm back at my outpost, I think. My boat is sinking. Oh, I don't have any planks. Come on. Well, see you later, boat. I'm dead now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Where is it? 
We're done being a boat. And there you go. That's how you can lose like a bunch of work in a matter of seconds in Sea of Thieves. It's, it's going to be a problem with this game. The guy I killed, I got nothing for killing him. He actually got teleported back to his boat that had my things on it. Um, so I did that motherfucker a favor, because he didn't have to walk back over there. I just threw him back onto it for him. Uh, that's super fucking dumb. ship back. They, were, they had some problems. But then I know once I turn it off and wait 30 minutes, I'm like, fuck, I want to play again. Okay, I have four very white screens in my face right now. Any one of them can stop. Well, I mean, yeah. Oh, yeah, also this game, you can just get killed when you're just here. Trying to turn in your quests or whatever. And that's super fucking irritating. It's like if in Destiny you could kill each other at the tower. It's genius. So I don't know if dying gets rid of one of my voyages or what, but this happened to me before too, or it just disappeared. Maybe it's because I used it on my boat, I guess. And maybe it's still... Yeah, it's, it's just here in my possession. What's going on up here? Nothing. That would be a lot cooler if you could catch that or ladder. Well, I guess. See what's going on in this one. Snake Island. What is that? Is this map in alphabetical order? Fucking missing it again. Oh, that thing. That's pretty far. I don't know about that one. Yeah, oof. Without a navigator. Okay, well, let's do it. Uh, we're going to try to go to Snake Island, and then I'll probably die along the way, and then we're going to call it a day. So we crank the wheel. We raise the anchor. And we begin to turn. Oh, 
we're hitting stuff. Sorry, Doc. Lower this. Straighten you out. Oh, cool. Let's drive right into that ship. Oh, Christ. Cool! Can't wait to die. Awesome. Well, this might go a lot faster than we all... Yeah, cool, here he comes. Somewhere. I wish I could just like be like, I don't have anything. Leave me alone, please. You're wasting your time and mine. Snake Island. It'd be really cool if I was just magically, well, kind of. If I maintain my course, I'll kind of thread the needle straight to Snake Island. Problem is, is maintaining my course. You bored of chasing me yet? Got a long way to go, you assholes. Cool. Maybe a little bit to the left. I'm about to level up in my little gold hoarder thing, or whatever the fuck. So that's something. You know, the best part is, is that once I get to wherever it is I'm going and these people immediately kill me, um, I think I'm going to have to just... Like, start all over. Or something. I don't know where the fuck they'll have me come back at. Who knows? <sighs> I always push circle when I'm looking down there to, like, stop looking at the map type of thing. And then I realize that just walk away. Not actually like in a minute. I could just like abandon my ship, just jump off, and maybe they won't see me, and then they'll chase an empty boat that has nothing on it at all.
You know, people were complaining or pointing out that you go long periods of time in this game without seeing anybody, but um, that's a good thing because when you see people, it sucks. And they really throw you off course as to what the fuck it is you were doing. And if you were constantly running into people, you would never be able to do anything in this game. I wish I would like customize my ship or sail or something. Maybe you can. Uh... Fuck is that emblem? It's probably ish. Sales. Left a bunch. Snake Island? Snake Island. Alright, so there's a bunch of chunks of Snake Island. I'm not really sure. Sails up! Alright, fuck you. Anchor down. Sails up. Stop. Alright, now it's time for those other dudes to catch up and fuck me up. So, cool. Can't wait for that to happen. Oh shit, I can't even read this. Stone beacon on the far west island cast off your fears, replace with music and ears. Far west island. That's, that's where I am. No, it's not. Stone Beacon. Doesn't matter. By the time I figure it out, I'll be getting killed by assholes anyway. This sure seems like a stone beacon. Hmm. I don't know how you like light a um, 
I don't know if you can light a fire. Like, can I hold a plank? These guys are having a gay old time fucking fucking up an empty boat. Cool for you. West Island, Stone Beacon. I don't know why. Maybe, maybe the things reveal themselves as you get to where they matter. Like I always thought that it was like, oh, the water washed it away or whatever, but. Maybe they just reveal themselves. What do we get for that? Nothing. He gets nothing, I get nothing. I lose nothing, he gains nothing. Back on my boat. Cool. Alright. Well, that's Sea of Thieves. <laughs>